I bought this storage unit for $180. So let's go ahead and get started, shall we? Before we get into the video, did you know that only a small portion of y'all are subscribed? So if you could subscribe right now, that'd be a huge help. All right, let's get to the video. Workstation, so let's go ahead and just start here, I guess. This is nothing that feels like clothes. So this says winter clothes. So let's see if it is winter clothes. Looks like it. Yeah, just more winter clothes and stuff. So, so, got a Sawzall, Milwaukee brand. That's pretty good. Got a sander, belt sander here. That's also pretty good. Black and Decker. And a Craftsman buffer. This is all like woodworking stuff. Like custom woodworking stuff, looks like. Okie doke. Yeah. Busted tote with more just tools and stuff in it. Old 7 up bottle. Hmm. Let's get one of these toolboxes, shall we? I want to do that. That way it doesn't. Oh, wow. Okay. That's heavy. That's why it's heavy. Bunch of just tools and stuff. So that's not too bad. Let's go ahead and do this one next. Uh, ooh. Prost, P R O S T. Could be good. Made in China. Oh uh, man, these are probably really good. Come here, give me. Uh, that's super rusted, which is unfortunate. Got a hatchet. Uh, I think that's a, uh, yeah, switchblade. That's actually nice looking. Okay. Be careful with that one. And this one. It's a shame they're all rusted though. Those old knives can do. Oh, that's a scythe. That's what that is. It's a super rusted blade, which is unfortunate. And then. It's like a Bowie knife of sorts. So that's an interesting little box. Uh, kitchen stuff. Which looks to be kitchen stuff. I'm trying to figure out where I'm going. Come on! Ugh. It's super heavy. More tools. And wow. There's a clamp, heavy duty clamp. That's pretty good. This one's super heavy too, yep. What do you want to think's in here? More tools? Mm -hmm. Shocker. <laughs> There's more tools. It's awesome though. You know what that is? It's an ammo box. Ooh. Uh, cast iron plate, skillet rather, batteries and rusted stuff, and a strap, nothing crazy, I'm not going to dig through that, I don't know if my tetanus shot is up to date or not, I got this thing, so I can find a brand or something on it, McPherson, model Mark 7, uh, draw weight of 20 pounds, one of the main reasons why I bought the unit. And we've got the arrows here as well. So. Yeah, so this is a ammo can, but I don't think nothing's in there. Yeah, it's empty. It's very old. Man. Very old. But 
That's okay. There might be weapons in here. Maybe, who knows? <clears throat> and I'll use this to start. Some more tools. Tools, maybe a little bit of jewelry. I don't really know. Can't tell. Nothing crazy, I don't think. This looks more like craft jewelry stuff. Yeah. Lots of beading. Yeah. So I'll probably list that on Marketplace. Not a whole lot in here. Yep. What are you? Other than Rusty and probably more tools. Yep, look at that. Rusty and more tools. Unsurprising. It's almost like they took this stuff from outside and moved into an indoor storage unit. Just clothes, blankets. What's <laughs> down there? There's another purse. Let's see if there's anything in here. The watch. Uh, other than that, nothing really else. Okay. Um, looks like <clears throat> just clothes and stuff, blankets, nothing crazy. Yeah. Clothes. So those will probably get donated. Looks like books and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing that I'm really too worried about keeping. So that one's probably going to the trash. Another one here. Looks like shoes. Nothing crazy. Oh, there's something. What are you? Yeah. Nothing. Yeah, so that's it for that box. Here we go. This might be something. Oh, there's a little bit of something. Pent up Doctor Strange. Oop. All this was in there, so I can scoop all this up and put it in there. Some of it might be, probably not. Doctor Strange, Batman, Captain America. They're nothing crazy. Probably not worth much at all. Oh, there you go. Move this out the way. Oh, you move this out of the way too. What do you? Nothing. So. Looks mostly like costume jewelry. Most likely that might be something there. Um. Yeah. Doesn't look too crazy. I don't think there's much else in there. So I'll keep this out to the side. And then I'll put everything else back in there. Wow. It's kind of neat. It's very vintage. Hmm. Needs to get cleaned. 1985. It has a certificate on the back. Uh, yeah, it does. Certificate of Limited Edition Iris by Barbara Mock. Numbered 45 out of 55, looks like. So that could be good. So this just says blankets. I trust it. Here's that matching stool. Winter clothes. This is just blankets. More blankets. I think this is just more. Here that says. Winter clothes. Yeah, okay. That's what I imagined. So it's all winter clothes and blankets more. So that's going to Goodwill. 
Yeah, I'm pretty sure they just moved everything from here. It was in an outside unit. And there's this. Oh, well, maybe not. Empty. Empty. Coloring books. A box that says acid. Oh, acid cigars. Which is full of nothing. So that's a nothing box. Or nothing bag, rather. This one's really heavy. It's full of something. Bunch of pencils there. What do you got in here, huh? Drawing stuff, coloring stuff, books, and pencils and stuff. So nothing in there. Definitely a crafter person. Yeah. What? Well, I don't know. It's kind of weird, you know, because it's like two different people. So you start out with all the tools and stuff, and then you reach all this stuff. So I wouldn't be surprised if it's two different people. This I'm imagining is nothing. Yeah. That box is nothing. Not a whole lot. That might have end up in my booth, I don't know. Maybe not. Um, yeah. Shoes. So that's it for that one. So this says shoes slash bags. I'm just gonna take a look real quick for any uh, Nike or, I mean, decent, which doesn't look like it. Let's do this foldy top one. There's some more jewelry. That's always good. Mm, it's very interesting because haven't, we haven't found any. Uh, you know, like personal items yet. It's kind of unique. This is interesting. Could be a little better. Okay, so that one's done. More clothes as well. This is interesting. Some watches and stuff. The Tigger watch is interesting. Mm -hmm. So nothing really else there. Um, let me move this up there. Nothing there. Nothing really else in there. Um, this one's really just kind of more trash, to be honest with you. Oh, there you go, there you go. Tack, salt, knife. That's pretty decent. So that's it for that one, or at least I'm calling it it for that one. There's something at the top here. Felt handles of something. Oh no, it's an extension cord. That's another box of nothing with a waffle iron. Nothing in there. Just looking for that one item to put it over the top, you know? Some 
Not in here, this is more tools. Yep, more tools. Hmm. Oh. Those are in decent enough shape. No dry rot too. So those might be worth something. There's nothing else in there. Kitchen ish stuff. I'm not worried about it. More purses. More purses and just random stuff, really. Um, calendar. Not a whole lot. Maybe another good Milwaukee tool. Nope. More just coloring, drawing stuff. Ceramic heater. Horseshoe. Maybe a lucky horseshoe, hopefully. Might be, I don't know. I saw some other medical stuff back there, so I don't know mm. if it's a medical thing or what. Nope. No, it looks like Christmas shop. Maybe something to apartment 56 or something. I don't know. Some sort of uh, Christmas decoration. Oh, it's a Michael Kors. It's in very bad shape. You can sell the medallion though. Can I? Mm-hmm. How much? I don't know. But people buy those medallions. Okay. like a uh, tool bag and clothes. There's something in here. More craft stuff. It's a shame. Well, for the amount of work this is, it's not worth it. Unless I find something else. About those. I cannot believe the amount of gas cans they have. You got a lot of them, that's for sure. Or, uh, winter stuff. Wouldn't you know it? More drawing books. Drawing pads. Um, these are stamps. There we go. Uh, food supplements. No, those are stamps. Yeah. It's an old stamp collection. Those are more stamps. And more nothing. Oh, that smells horrible. It smells like a grandmother's, uh, like a grandmother's medicine cabinet. Mm.
So that's gonna do it for this episode. It was uh, a lot more stuff than what I bargained for. So uh, I gotta go empty all this now. So if you guys enjoyed, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. It really helps me out. And I'll see y'all in the next episode. Peace.